James Melendez, James the wine guy here to share and celebrate this beautiful and special wine from Rioja with you today. From the producer Bodegas Darien, the reserve of 2002 vintage and um, a privilege for me to be tasting this. I'm always imagining what was I doing in 2002 and um, it wasn't that long ago and yet in some ways it was over a decade ago. Uh, this is 2013 and when you think in those terms that's pretty amazing. Amazing I think that I drink a lot of old wines from Rioja and privileged to do so. Now very interestingly enough I do not taste a lot of Reserva or Gran Reserva, so it's always a treat and uh, a privilege for me to do so. So this is 85% Tempranillo, 10% Garnacha, Garnache, 5% Mazuelo, which is Carignan, and uh, beautiful architecture here, very simple. So being in the Rioja myself, I passed by this bodega, and I thought, I gotta, pa I gotta come in, I gotta visit. And um, unfortunately, I didn't have the time on my last visit. And hopefully at some point in the future, I will be able to stop in, have some wonderful food, and enjoy all their, their wines as well. So I've been tasting Bodegas Darien for years. So this spends one year in French and American oak in bottled two years minimum aging. And uh, in order to get this seal here, which is um, uh, the Rioja certification that this is a reserve of wine. And um, reserve of wines, and, and actually wines from uh, Rioja reach superbly well. And I think it's a, a testament. I, I'm tasting 10, 15, even 25-year-old uh, Rioja wines, and I think they just have been sublime and beautiful and wonderful and enjoyable with food. So in this, gorgeous scent characteristics on this wine here, just um, almost a liveliness and a freshness to the wine. I'm, I'm getting an, an essence and a scent of cherry orchard during fall time, leather, sage, and a bit of fennel as well. So here we go. Take a taste of the wine, tell you what it's like, and give a point score. Mmm. A balanced wine. I think that the earthiness on the Garnacha and the Mazuelo really seem together, uh, so together with the Tempranillo. It's a fantastic uh, combination. Not rare, you're going to find this quite often, but I think this adds the characterization of that earthiness to the wine itself. Some notes of black cherry, red plum, uh, notes of blackberry, white pepper, fennel, marjoram, cardamom, and a sense of cinnamon as well. So beautiful notes here. So this wine is a 9.2 out of a 10.0 scale. You can think of that as 92 points out of 100 points. And I really recommend a visit to uh, Rioja. It's a fantastic place to visit. Uh, easy to get to, uh, not as difficult to get to, shall I say. You can fly into uh, Bilbao and uh, train it down or take a bus or rent a car. There's many ways of getting there. We'll go from Madrid and uh, even, a, a, um, I think, once or twice daily flights from Madrid into uh, Logroño, the capital of um, the Rioja. Fantastic place to visit. Again, 9.2, 10.0 scale. More reviews, jamesthewineguy.com. Subscribe to my videos on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Vimeo, Google+, Pinterest. Salud.